Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Indian School of Physics. Guys, this is Nitin here, and today I've come with a very innovative problem in uh, kinematics. Yesterday only in a live class I framed this problem, and uh, the results were uh, very nice. And uh, guys, you can jo join our uh, Telegram uh, group. Its link will be given in the description, so anyone uh, can join this public group. Uh, here you can see. And the problem statement for a particle moving in a straight line it's a v square versus s graph is shown in the diagram find the time after which particle will stop here v is the velocity and s is the displacement of the particle so you can see here 0 to s naught this graph is linearly changing and reaching from v naught square to 4 v naught square and after that it is following a parabola opening downward from s naught to 3 s naught so we can uh, break this problem into two parts one is 0 to s naught let's say time taken is t1 and another one is uh, s naught to 3 s naught time taken is t2 so we have to find out t1 plus t2 all right uh, so here you can see the first part let's uh, analyze motion from 0 to s naught and you can easily figure out that v square is equal to u square plus 2 a s so from there you will be getting the idea that uh, this uh, is constant acceleration all right otherwise uh, slope of this graph also you can say it is uh, 2 v dv by ds which is double of the acceleration so directly since it is a straight line its slope is uh, constant and that means acceleration is constant all right so uh, here i can apply 4 v naught square is equal to v naught square plus 2 a1 s naught so this acceleration is known to us and the value from here to here is 3 v naught square by 2 s naught this is the acceleration so now time calculation becomes very easy because uh, here velocity will go from v naught to 2 v naught so this you can write v is equal to u plus a t so 2 v naught and this is v naught so time t1 we will be getting as v naught by a1 so when this a1 value i am substituting here i am getting 2 s naught by 3 v naught i am getting 2 s naught by 3 v naught so this is the time uh, t1 here known to us now let's analyze the motion from 0 to 3 s naught so here it's a parabola and uh, parabola this is y axis and this is x axis so this parabola must be of the form of uh, here okay so you can locate this point so s naught and uh, 4 v naught square and it is the vertex here it is the vertex here so this part is uh, part of a parabola so i can write its uh, equation so it is a parabola passing through this part point so equation must be of this form y is equal to minus kx square kind of function so but it's a uh, uh, vertex is at uh, some x1 y1 so y minus y1 is equal to minus k times x minus x1 whole square so let's substitute here so y minus y1 this is v square minus 4 v naught square is equal to minus k times uh, s minus s naught whole square all right after this we know at 3s naught velocity is 0 so v is 0 at s equal to 3s naught so v is 0 and uh, this will become minus 4 v naught square is equal to minus k 3s naught minus s naught whole square so 2s naught square so when i substitute the value i am getting k as v naught square by s naught square so when i substitute the value of k here i am getting this uh, velocity as a function of displacement uh, which is th coming as v square is equal to minus uh, 4 v naught square minus v naught square by s naught square s minus s naught whole square all right after this what we can do is just differentiate this with respect to time so 2 v dv by dt minus v naught square by s naught square this will give zero so only this term will be there so into differential of this so 2 times s minus s naught into ds by dt ds by dt is velocity and this velocity will get cancelled 2 and 2 will get cancelled dv by dt i am getting as uh, minus of v naught square times s minus s naught from here i can say this dv by dt will become d2s by dt square and you bring it this side so that is plus v naught square by s naught square s minus s not equal to zero now this is very surprising equation i was puzzled when uh, during the discussion i figured this out 
because if you solve it by traditional method this will be taking hell lot of time and uh, this problem will lose the charm but the moment you will figure out this is shm uh, and its equilibrium is at s equal to s not that means this is the equilibrium and this position is extreme so from here to here this uh, shm is happening or you can say the part of uh, a simple harmonic motion and since it is going from v max to zero so this must resemble uh, that uh, mean position to extreme motion parabola part is uh, mean to extreme position motion all right uh, now after this uh, it's very easy for us t2 will become it's like this is the mean position from here to here t by 4 t by 4 t by 4 and t by 4 again so this time is t2 which is t by 4 so pi by 2 omega it will come because uh, you can write t by 4 is uh, 2 pi by omega divided by 4 so pi by 2 omega it will come and omega value you can substitute from here you will be getting pi by 2 s naught by v naught and t stopping t1 plus t2 when i simplify i'm getting such a nice answer in this problem so you can see and i can ask this question in integer type that answer is of the form a by b plus pi by a then the value of a plus b will be that is uh, 5 so i hope this uh, question is clear and uh, you can have this idea like there are many other possibilities in this problem and uh, similar looking problem so have this idea of uh, acceleration in uh, mind v square s graph and parabola will lead you to the shm equation most likely uh, guys this uh, unacademy sat or unsat exam is happening on uh, uh, June 4th and 5th and uh, 2nd June is the last date to register and uh, this is one of the biggest exam uh, it's happening for ITJ, NEET, UG and class 9th and 10th and across 40 cities so here you'll be getting a chance to join an academy offline centers also or online anything is uh, fine the biggest part is you'll be getting nine up to 90 percent scholarship and overall uh, the scholarship pool is 150 cr and uh, apart from that the top 40 rankers will be getting an iphone and test takers will anyone who is writing this test will get the unacademy t-shirt all right and uh, you can use my code in order to enroll for this exam and that is nathan sir uh, make sure to make sure to uh, enroll for this exam you can ask your friends and other people in your circle also and uh, this is also like uh, it is the last date and uh, you can get up to 43 percent so you can say plus subscription so uh, this is available almost 43 is, uh, percent discount and similarly iconic and this is also 34 percent so you can uh, uh, use my code nathan sir in order to connect with me on an academy so guys that's it i hope you have enjoyed this problem because uh, this was kind of eureka moment for me when i just uh, it clicked uh, because otherwise we would have gone by traditional method but somehow that idea striked and it became a very very nice problem so that's it guys i'll be coming up with another video very soon thank you